Uh, here we are at the Sydney Mind, Body and Spirit Festival 2008, here at the Sydney Convention Centre at Darling Harbour. As you can see, we've got everything here to do with spirits, from astrology to alternative medicine to faith healing, and even out-of-body experiences. I've yet to see it yet, but apparently it's all happening here. Make up your own minds. Floating <laughs> frogs, I get I um, stop selling water. I just met one of the guys who's involved in this show. This Channel Seven show. Which show? Uh, it's oh, called, the one that they're doing. It's called the one. They want me as a judge. I met the psychic, the president of the psychics, and he said they want me. They've built the sets. It's a done deal. But yeah. I've learned in TV, you never, you never. Uh, what's the word? Count the chickens before you're eating them on the table. Before you're watching it. I'm finding that out. I did that whole trick to people at work, just going, oh, would you? Just a mate. Mm. <laughs> The process of thinking creates headaches. So the mind created three things. The mind created the idea of separation. The mind created the idea of time, past, present, future. And the mind created the idea of good and bad. God, in our view, or in our really experience, does not exist. God only exists when you have an experience of what we call oneness. God as God does not exist. You can't link to God on your mobile phone. And God is not going to send you letters either by a pigeon or by a postman. And if you are going to go to a church and synagogue and a temple and you are going to ask God help, God doesn't recognize you because God is not there. But if you go through the bridge of compassion and you bring the love within your heart into your consciousness, you are going to get very close to the experience of God. There you can see Richard Saunders over there walking towards us and a few of the Australian skeptics. That's <laughs> it. you've enjoyed your visit here to the 2008 Mind, Body and Spirit Festival here at the Convention Centre on a Darling Harbour. Maybe you've seen a few things you like and you've made up your own minds on things and just really had a taste and a little bit of a feel of what it's all been like and what it's been about this year. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Hello there, just as an afterthought, you're probably thinking, did I actually buy anything at the festival? Well, uh, yes, I did. Okay, they're all down here. What did I buy? I bought my alkaline bottled water. Apparently, most waters that you buy, mineral water, whatever, they have too much acidic content. That's not good for you. Apparently, this will help my health and help prevent prostate cancer too, I believe. 
We've also got here a special chocolate bar, which is supposed to be a very, very healthy chocolate bar. I can eat as much as I like, and it even contains uh, berries. Brilliant. And we've got our heat packs. Now, I, I, I like the heat packs. It's actually really warm. I think it's working. It's brilliant. And you can actually feel it. Ah, lovely and cosy.